Hello, St. Andrews, and welcome to this week's edition of Chancel Chat, the first uh, Chancel Chat of the new year, 2017. It's Wednesday, the 4th of January, the 10th day of the 12 days of Christmas. Uh, the Christmas season will officially come to an end on Friday of this week, uh, January 6th, as we celebrate the Feast of the Epiphany of our Lord, which commemorates the wise men coming to uh, make their visit uh, to the baby Jesus in, uh, in Nazareth. Um, so the question is, what would have happened if the wise men had been women? Well, it's a very interesting uh, question, but uh, first of all, they would have arrived uh, on time because they would have stopped to ask for directions. They would have helped to deliver the baby, cleaned the stable, made a casserole, brought practical gifts, not gold, frankincense, and myrrh, but something much more practical, and there would be peace on earth. So uh, we're going to be celebrating the Feast of the Epiphany here at St. Andrew's with a potluck supper beginning at 6 p.m. on Friday evening in the parish house. Uh, immediately following our supper, we'll be having a simple celebration of the Holy Eucharist and um, we'll be finished by before 7.30, I'm sure. So please uh, plan to join us for this uh, celebration of this wonderful feast of the Epiphany of our Lord. Uh, looking ahead to this weekend, uh, Deacon Joe will be preaching at all three of the services, and we'll be celebrating the feast of the baptism of our Lord. It's always the first Sunday after the Epiphany, and we'll be uh, renewing our baptismal covenant at all three of the services uh, this weekend. Uh, then looking ahead to next week on Monday evening of uh, Monday, January 9th, our monthly vestry meeting will be meeting at 7 p.m. here at the church. And of course, all the vestry meetings are open to members of the, of the parish who are interested in attending. So please consider yourselves invited and, and join us if you're able. Uh, then looking ahead further uh, into the month of January, uh, Martin Luther King uh, weekend is the weekend of January 14th and 15th, and our Rancocas Valley Clergy Association is sponsoring two very interesting and I think uh, uh, important events uh, that will be happening, occurring that weekend. The first one is on Saturday evening, the 14th, at 6 p.m. at Sacred Heart uh, Roman Catholic Church here in, in Mount Holly. They'll, we'll be doing a dinner theater and I think this will be a very interesting event. Uh, and it's open, of course, to uh, all anyone in the, in the community that would like to attend. So that's uh, Saturday evening at 6 p.m. at Sacred Heart. And then on Sunday evening at 6.30, here at St. Andrews, um, a liturgy celebrating uh, the life and legacy of the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King. Uh, so um, we commend these um, events to you and, and encourage you to participate if you're able. Our annual congregational meeting will be held on Sunday, January 22nd. We'll have a single service at 9 o'clock in the sanctuary, followed immediately by our congregational meeting. Uh, so, of course, this is a very important event in the life of our parish, and we encourage all members of the parish to participate in the annual meeting. Uh, then on, on Sunday evening, the 29th of um, of January at five o'clock, Susan and I are, are going to be hosting an orientation meeting. We are planning to take a pilgrimage to the Holy Land uh, one year from now in January of 2018. And this meeting on the 29th will simply to provide some basic information about the trip. So if you have an interest um, uh, in learning more about what the plan is, uh, please plan to join us uh, for this orientation meeting probably last about an hour, uh, beginning at 5 o'clock on Sunday evening, uh, January 29th. I'd like to express on behalf of uh, Susan and myself our profound gratitude for your very generous uh, Christmas gift this year. Uh, it was uh, a, a surprise and uh, very much appreciated. So thank you for all who contributed uh, to that, uh, that Christmas gift. And one final announcement. Um, you may have received an email this week uh, from our parish administrator about the Amazon Smile program. And we want to thank uh, Frank Marchese for uh, registering St. Andrews as an official charity with Amazon Smile. 
And what this means is that any purchase that you make on Amazon, 5% uh, of the purchase price will come back to help support our ministry here at St. Andrews. So um, uh, there's information about Amazon Smile on the website, and you need to sign up for it in order to uh, participate. Uh, there will also be an insert in the bulletin uh, next Sunday. But if you have any questions, uh, give Chris a call in the parish office and she'll uh, help you to register uh, so that any purchases that you make in the future uh, will, uh, will help to uh, support the ministry here at St. Andrews. So, so that's about all I have for this week. Uh, wishing you and your family a bright uh, and blessed and uh, peaceful and healthy new year. And we'll talk again uh, next week. God bless you.